welcome back to my channel. Today I am decluttering and cleaning out our linen closet which is right behind us and I thought I would take you along with the process and I'm going to just jump right into it and show you the inside of this linen closet. So this is our linen closet and it is on the second floor of our home. It right now is currently housing all of our bath towels and medicines and our vacuum and travel supplies and when you see it you'll notice our organization is not working but that will be for another video so stay tuned for that today we are just decluttering paring down and cleaning out this closet to freshen it up for that so let's open it and uh, i hope you're not too scared <laughs> So this is the closet from the top, and I'll just pan down. Okay, to the bottom. And on the door, I have the iron, and the ironing board is behind me right now. So I'm gonna take everything out of this closet and give it a quick clean down and go through it with the KonMari method like I have done in the past and get rid of any expired products, anything we're not using, and then only keep the things that we need. So this is what I'm looking at right now. I just took everything on those shelves. Just, I left the medicines at the top. I have those shelves empty. Cleared out most of the floor except for the bin. And now I'm going to go through these just to make more room because it's such a limited space. I'm working in the hallway up here. And uh, yeah, so I'm going to clear this out, go through, see what I can donate, what I can throw out, and what I'm going to put back into the linen closet. A touchdown. When all you need is some support.
medicines and supplies. I'm actually thinking I'm going to be storing it downstairs, but I'm going to go through and see what's expired and what we're, um, shouldn't have on hand anymore and then dispose of it properly and then hopefully not have to use such a large um, system. so small watch the clock ticking off the wall but tonight i'm letting it go spend my coin for sure okay i just wanted to give you a little mid check-in point on exactly where i am i've got rid of a lot of things um there's no organization to this right now because that's not the point of this video, the point of this video is just clearing it out and getting rid of the things that I'm not going to be using anymore. So as you can see here, the floor is pretty much empty. This is the travel. This is all I have for like sample travel size products. I try not to buy as many because we just kind of buy as we go. This one here stayed the same. It's just my um, curlers if I choose to use them for a holiday party or whatnot. Mr. Clean Magic Erasers I threw in here and then I have a vacuum bag which will be the last one I use because hopefully we're getting a new vacuum soon. And this is a cleaning cloth for like cleaning products. Here I just, there's no rhyme or reason to any of these bins. These are just all products that we are keeping. So I'm not even gonna bother going through those. Um, I have a plan to use this for my Lush products so they're still in the bag right now. And these are cleaning products that I'll use to clean out this space. Towels, and I do have some new ones um, to come, but I am not sure when I'm gonna get to the next part of this video. So right now they're staying, but they're probably gonna go. Uh, these are curtains that Matt wants me to keep. I don't know why, but I'll respect that. And these are gonna go in the kid's playroom. Not the playroom, in the kid's playhouse. Then this is one of Maddie's quilts. That's the humidifier and that is curtains and Connor's baby quilt. Baby quilt. This is what we're getting rid of. Um, there's that there is a curtain that is garbage, the garbage rod. This here I haven't used in ages so I'm just going to donate it. It still works, I just haven't used it. The Swiffer handle broke off the other Swiffer, so I'm going to get rid of that. <sighs> Two bags of garbage. And then behind me, this is all of our medicines that are good, and they're going to go downstairs. And that red container is completely empty now, so that's going to go. But this is what the closet is looking like right now, and I couldn't be happier. I have so many plans for this space, um, but my number one goal is to make it functional. But, so... This is what it looks like right now. I'm gonna be myself, or I could be someone else. No one's stopping me now. I'm gonna skip my breaks, I'm gonna make mistakes. I just wanna feel alive. It's just what I do when I'm out, so I need not to hold me down, feel alive. this video make sure to hit the red subscribe button down below to subscribe to my youtube family and to hit the bell to receive notifications when i post new content which will include the after and tour of this linen closet so until next time i hope you have a wonderful day and a magical evening and as always take care thanks so much for watching bye